Back in 1914, the same year as the world's first commercial airline flight, Addison Hall was shockingly engulfed by a runaway fire. It all started on Saturday, February 28th, around 5.30 p.m. President Cohn was conducting a routine inspection tour when he smelled smoke. With the help of several brave students, they discovered the smoke and fire rolling from an upstairs classroom on the northeast corner. At the time, River Forest only had a volunteer fire department, so other departments were called in to help. Despite their best efforts, nearly all of Edison Hall was destroyed by the fire. Fortunately, everyone got out safely and no students, staff, or firefighters were hurt that day. The cause? Faulty electrical wiring. The total loss came to $85,000, including seven of the ten iconic stone columns, a museum, college libraries, and all kinds of historical records. It sounds grim, but there is a happy ending. People from all over the country rallied behind Concordia. With their help and support, Addison Hall was rebuilt and back in service almost exactly one year from its first dedication. It stands proudly today as an icon and legendary landmark of Concordia University, Chicago.